Hi, I'm Erin Morgenstern, author of The Night Circus. My new novel, The Starless Sea, goes on sale this November. The Night Circus started as part of a National Novel Writing Month, which is a um, online-based competition to write 50,000 words in 30 days, usually held in November. Um, and I'd done it for several years, just kind of writing for myself, and I never really planned for it. And I was writing one November, and I got really bored with everything that was happening. I had these Edward Gorey-esque guys in big fur coats, like, wandering around and being mysterious and doing very little else. And I was dreadfully bored with myself, and I needed something exciting to happen. And the NaNoWriMo rule of thumb is usually, when in doubt, just add ninjas. And I didn't want ninjas with my guys in fur coats, so I decided, what could be ninja-esque that would make this exciting? So I sent all these characters to the circus. And the circus that appeared in my head at that moment was way more interesting than anything I had written so far. And it kind of came like fully formed in my head. It had all these black and white striped tents and a bonfire in the middle, and I didn't know why yet. But I kind of eventually abandoned that outside project and spent a long time writing just about the circus. And that book eventually became The Night Circus. The hardest thing about writing The Night Circus was finding the story within the circus itself. I wrote a lot about just the circus in general, and I uh, originally the sections about the tents were very long, and I cut them down. But um, finding what was actually happening and giving it a plot and a structure and adding the competition to it came much later, and that was kind of the hardest part, was figuring out what story was taking place in this space. too long. Um, the Night Circus and the Starless Sea both actually took uh, like total from when they started um, about five years to write from start to finish. Um, and it's because I, I tend to be a rewriter. That's where I find my story in, in the rewriting and the like learning everything and um, kind of really familiarizing myself with the story as I go along. But there are pieces of the Starless Sea that are much older than that. There are pieces that I just jotted down without knowing what they were, like maybe 15 years ago. When I went to write a second book, I didn't really want to write a sequel to The Night Circus. I felt like The Night Circus ends kind of nicely and, and I could explore the world further, maybe someday, but it wasn't what I wanted to do next. And I wanted to do something um, that still felt fantastical and still felt like that sort of book that I love that plays with um, the edges of genre. And I settled on really wanting to write a book about books. And as I started working on a book about books, I realized that I was actually telling a book about stories um, because it turned into a book that was not only about books themselves and an underground labyrinth full of books, but also a book about fate and time in video games. And that's The Starless Sea. Thank you for visiting the Night Circus, and I hope you enjoy sailing the Starless Sea.